Hi everyone, today we are taking the train north of Inverness to the town of Brora. Now, as the seagull flies, Brora is 39 miles north of Inverness, but uh, the train itself, the journey is actually 90 miles because it has to wind its way around quite a few different uh, inlets which forms part of the North Sea coast. As a result, it's quite a scenic journey. So I'm going to get on the train now and I'll see you on board. When I booked this uh, ticket through the ScotRail website, I was able to get a window seat and I thought, aha, excellent. And then I realised it was on that side of the train and not on that side of the train and that's where all the scenery is. So I found a seat which is unreserved and I plan to be here for the next two hours. Here we are in Brora. That was two hours of noise on that train. A good natured crowd, they got on at Dingwall. They were all Ross County fans. Um, I'm guessing Ross County are playing away from home today. So what do Ross County fans do when there's nothing else happening? They come to Brora to watch Brora Rangers play Wick Academy. There was a whole crowd of them and they were, you know, good natured. Um, the game doesn't start for another two hours yet. So I'm going to explore around the town and I'm taking you along with me. It's definitely colder here than it was in Inverness. This is a beautiful beach, but I can feel the frostbite kicking in. I think we'll head back into town. That way.
I once knew a girl named Nicole. She was from Auckland, New Zealand. And she once told me the most exciting thing that happens on a daily basis in Auckland is the switching on of the overhead streetlights at sunset. Now I'm pretty sure there are more exciting things that really do happen in Auckland, but I always remembered that. Here in Brora, I think this is the most exciting thing that happens on a daily basis. Right, that might be a little bit harsh to Brora, but it's a nice little town, friendly little town. I've had three people actually say hello to me, complete strangers. You wouldn't get that back home. Right, now to the football. Gee, I hope it's not sold out. I was just thinking, I know so little about Brora Rangers and Wick Academy, I don't even know what colours they play in, until I found the official Brora Rangers shop. Well, against all odds, they managed to squeeze me in. This is what real football is about. Half time at the big game and traditional meat pie. No bob roll this time. Bob roll is a meat extract. You either love it or you hate it. And I fall into that latter category. I can't stand the stuff. But I do like meat pies. <laughs> So I said to myself, the team in red, support the team in red. Brewer Rangers, support the team in red. And then I saw what Wick Academy were wearing, and they were wearing vertical stripes, black and white vertical stripes, just like my local teams at Mirren. And I have to remain faithful to the cause. I could not support a team against St Mirren, so I supported Wick Academy, and just like St Mirren, they were comprehensively gubbed 4-1. Anyway, I hope you've enjoyed this video. It's been something different. Please subscribe, and I'll see you next time.